Hello, everyone. Welcome to another exciting yet relaxing episode of ASMR Sherry's Variety Show. And this show is especially for those of you who maybe had a very long day, a long week. I thought, what would help you relax? So I thought I'd share with you some of the things that I like to do when I experience a rough patch. I like to take a nice long soak in the bathtub. And maybe you do too. And if any of you haven't done that in a long time, I would suggest you give it a try. So I have some things here I think just might help you relax. Now, one thing that I like to do when I take a bath I like to light a candle, a scented candle, and I brought one to show you. This can be any, anything you like, but this one has, don't know if you can see, three wicks, so it will really give off a lot of scent. So let me light that now. I think when you put this in your bathroom, when you're taking your bath, it'll be a little more special. But for now, I'll just set this off to the side. Here's another suggestion I have for you. This is a candle it's an electric candle so you don't have to worry about it it just gives the same ambiance and I don't know that the camera is picking this up but there's a little flame inside that flickers back and forth so I'll put this off to the side too Also, when you have a tough day, you might like to surround yourself with something positive. After your bath, you might put on a shirt like mine that says, blessed beyond measure. Yeah, don't dwell on the, on the tensions of the day, but let's try to lift our spirits and relax. Another thing that makes taking a nice long bath so much nicer than a quick shower is first of all, I would suggest that you schedule time for that because this is about taking time and washing away the cares of the day. But I like a pretty shower cap. Mm -hmm. 
some have velour inside. This one just has a soft plastic. It will protect your hairstyle too. So if you're going to take a nice bath, go all in with candles, with a shower cap, and you might select some relaxing music as well. I have another thing to show you if you don't want to wear a shower cap you can wear this it's a little headband you just put it on and it will protect your hair from the back and the sides and it looks really cute this is white and it has two pink pom-poms, but it's a real soft headband. So picture yourself. You're soaking in your tub. You're washing away the cares of the day. Your candles are lit. Perhaps your music is playing softly. And one thing I would like to show you is a nice sponge. I like this. For at the end of the bath, It's nice to rinse yourself off. With a sponge like this. This one has a little rope. You can hang it up to dry. And it also has a suction cup that you can put on the tile of the bathroom and let it dry. But this is a very nice sea sponge that you should get for yourself. Another thing is this, it stretches, and this cloth is made special to get your back. I'll show you, like this. You'll feel really good. Now I know some people like loofahs or bubble baths, and I'm not opposed to those things, but I do want to show you something that I like, and it has a dual purpose. This is a special brush for your back. Just take it like this.
this. Or you can go from the bottom up. But I like to use this as a back scratcher. I find that it works really better than back scratchers that are shaped like a little hand. This one is nice for scratching your back and for washing your back. So I would really recommend this. Some people, as I said, might like bubble bath, but I have something here. This is Dr. Teal's pink. Himalayan mineral soak. Dr. Teal's is not expensive and it comes in a lot of different soaks. But I chose this one because if I've been working in the yard and I'm pretty sore, I find that this helps relax the muscles. Let's look at the back and see what it says. Pure Epsom salt to ease aches and soreness from muscle pains. Pink Himalayan salt right here. That's to replenish and recharge. And this over here. Says bergamot and sweet orange to help rejuvenate the body. And it also says it helps provide relief from stress, but they have, for example, lavender, because lavender helps some people relax, so they too can sleep. And they have uh, peppermint, maybe if you're congested or have allergies, a soak with peppermint will make you feel better. So. You can use bubble bath for fun and for the fragrance, but I like Dr. Teal's Epsom salt soak. Now, while you're in your bath, You may be enjoying your music, your candles, a nice bubble bath or a uh, Epsom salt bath. You're just relaxing, washing the cares away. You have your special uh, shower cap on. Here's something else that's just for fun.
this is a little rubber ducky. Everybody likes a rubber ducky. Can you see? This is a little girl duck. And this one with the top hat is a little boy. And they're kind of fun to have in your bath. So you can pick these up and maybe Bed Bath and Beyond. Now, some people, they might enjoy a cup of tea after their bath. Maybe some want a glass of wine. But if it's a tough day, what about a big glass of ice cold chocolate milk? That's something I enjoy. It just tastes great and makes me feel it makes me feel good and I also brought I show you this is a nice soft robe so after your bath isn't it nice to put on a soft robe and maybe just whew, sit down for a minute or two and just feel how good you feel. Smell the fragrance of the lovely candles and just feel satisfied that you took that time for yourself. But a nice soft robe is something that I think you should have. And we can talk further about other ways to relax. But for those of you who may be having a tough day, a long day, I just thought I'd share with you some of the things that I think would be nice for you to try. Things that might make you relax and then put your feet up and your head back and say boy I'm glad this day is over and tomorrow will bring, bring a better one so for everybody watching I wish you relaxation sweet dreams and I invite you all to come back again real soon where we can share more of our experiences and uh, I can also tell you that I have more shows planned for you that I think will hold your interest and also help you relax. So with that, I wish you a very good night's sleep.